We are doing CA final SCMP self pace papers MCQ. The chapter that we all are doing right now is standard costing. So let's look forward for this question. Deciding the selling price of the new product in the market is most difficult decision. Honestly, it is because you don't know what is the right price. Uh, if it works, it was the right price. If it does not work, it was a wrong price. Okay. While doing the variance analysis, the manager of the sales and the marketing department uh, of the company is interested to know which of the following is not responsible for sales price variance. So he's asking which one of them is not a factor that is responsible for sales price variance. Bring the four options, please. A, higher discounts given to the customers in order to encourage bulk purchases. Okay. B, B over here is what? Failure to satisfy the demand due to production difficulties. What does it mean? I'll tell you. C, better sales price realization. Okay, D, in this case, market conditions or economic conditions forcing changes in prices across the industry. Think of the answer first. Please think and comment. That is the only way you're going to be learning your MCQs. Okay, that is the only way. So that is whatever I'm trying to make these videos for. Comment the right answer with the logic if you can. Pause the video over here. So let's look forward for the four options. See, how do you compute selling price variance? Selling price variance is at what price you had to sell minus at what price did you sell into actual quantity sold. A, higher discounts given to the customers in order to encourage bulk purchases. If you're going to be telling the customers, if you purchase in bulk, I'll give you discount. Then actual selling price will become lower. Selling price variance will get affected. We are not arguing it is good or bad. No, we are just trying to say, will it affect selling price variance? Yes, it will be. B, failure to satisfy demand due to production difficulties. Okay. Failure to satisfy demand. Okay, failure to satisfy demand due to production difficulties. Now, what is the meaning of this? Suppose uh, you had to use some materials, okay, whenever you are producing something. You did not use that material in a proper way and more materials was not available. Example. So material became a limiting factor. So there was a production difficulty. We cannot be producing more. Will it affect selling price variance? I really think that it does not. How will that affect your selling price? Let me have one other example. Your machines were frequently under a breakdown. So your production was becoming a problem. Now, but your selling price variance will not get affected due, due to that because your actual selling price in any case has got no correlation with your production difficulties beta. So as per me, B can, B can be the answer because B does not affect selling price variance. Let's talk of C. Better sales price realization. You thought you'll sell the product at 10 rupees, but ultimately you sold at 13. So better sales realization. So I think so. C will be a reason for sales price variance. D. Market conditions or economic conditions forcing the changes in the prices across the industry. Simple thing, suppose during COVID, you all will understand that market conditions were bad. Many companies reduced their prices of their products because market conditions were bad. So if they reduce the prices, beta selling price variance will get affected. No. So A will affect selling price variance. C will affect uh, selling price variance. D will affect the selling price variance. So answer obviously should be D over here. So D is going to be the correct answer. See, sometimes it will happen that in order to be getting the correct answer, you will have to try to negate the other answers. So if you are ever confused, if you do not directly know the answer, then always better to think about each and every option, cross out the wrong option. You might directly just get the correct option by that slide, slightly a longer way, but then it works sometimes. Okay. So that's it about uh, this question. I'll see you all next time with another MCQ. Bye.